Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you an eBay slash AliExpress haul. This is a summer haul um, for a toddler girl. I've got one bought item in this as well. And I'm also super excited to show you my very favorite dress that I've bought from eBay thus far. I've been shopping on eBay for a very long time. And if you haven't seen my eBay tips video, I'll link it in the cards and down below. If you're new to eBay and you're a bit hesitant about buying from there, then that video will help you kind of filter through all the products on that site and be able to make a good decision in your purchase. First thing I'm going to show you is a really cute set and I actually bought my son like a matching set. You'll see what I mean when I show you um, his set as well. But this is the little set that I've bought my daughter for summer. She did wear this a ton during our summer here in Australia. This is a super cute buy and it's actually really soft and good material. I'll link the pricing up here and I'll try and do it in the description as well um, to this actual listing that I bought this from if you're interested in buying any of these products. Um, but it does come with like a hoodie which is all like floral and it's got the floral little pocket details there as well and then the shorts are all floral with just a little bit of black stripe on the bottom now the fabric for this the actual black and white section is like cotton polyester material however the actual floral section is kind of like a swimwear material so i actually prefer the top better than the shorts because this actually feels like a swimsuit and you probably could even wear the bottoms as a swimsuit if you really wanted to um, because it just has that material, that swimsuit feel of that. Um, the tie here does have a tie but it doesn't actually function to tie in the waist at all which is a little bit annoying if you do have a child with a smaller waistline and you do need that function of it being able to be pulled in. So just keep that in mind that this this little tie here does not actually work as um, you know to cinch in the waist. Um, but overall, I think this is a really cute set and pretty good for the price that I got it for. I'm just going to show you the matching set that I got for Christopher. They actually wore this whilst on holidays on the same day, so it looks super cute um, when they're like side by side. But his is black and white like this. So this is the top with the hoodie. So it's like leaves, I want to say, like a leaf print, and the bottoms are like this. Now, unlike Adriana's, where she had two different materials on her, this is a just full cotton polyester. There's no, um, the, the hood does not have that swim like fabric on there, um, nor does the shorts. So these are all just cotton polyester, which I actually do prefer a lot um i just find this material a lot more comfortable on the skin especially for a child this just has like an elastic waist it doesn't have a tie or anything like that um, but this is the print here it's just black on the bottom and again with the top um, for reference the size is 110 for christopher set and adriana's is 80. I think this was a one-year-old size and I believe Christopher's was a 4T. So if you're interested um, in knowing the conversion, it's 110 for this particular listing and then it's 80 and then it's 80 for the one-year-old. But I'll try and link the actual listing itself down below so you can check the sizes and conversions yourself if you want to buy one of these outfits for your children. Next thing is just some shorts that I got Adriana. So these are the shorts that I got. Um, they're like a red color. They look a lot brighter in the viewfinder right now. They're actually like a burgundy red. Um, so I don't think that's coming across on camera. Um, but this is what they look like here. They've got like a little fringe thing on the top and a tie waist. And it's just elasticated there. And the leg holes have an elastic there as well. The next thing is, is a one piece swim set. And it looks like this. So it's got little flamingos all over it. It's got these little frilly sides as well. And then the back of it, I don't know if you can really tell when it's not on the body. 
um, but it's got these two big bows that sit on the shoulders and then on the back it crisscrosses like that. I'll insert a photo here of Adriana actually wearing it because it looks super, super cute on and it fits her perfectly. I'm so happy with this purchase. I believe this was an AliExpress um, purchase and the size is 80 for this as well. So again, it's a one year um, size if you're interested for reference. I have to say I did buy another swimsuit of AliExpress that was like a red swimsuit. I'll insert it over here for you. Um, but I've already got rid of this one, unfortunately. I wasn't actually planning on doing this video, so I didn't think to keep it. But the reason I got rid of it is because it was super, super tiny. Like, I mean super tiny. It, it was pretty much half the size of this. So this is already a pretty small swimsuit. It does fit her. She's two years old, um, but this is a size one because that's the size that she wore during summer. Um, but basically, it was half the size. So... It was only that big and I did contact the seller and ask them if I had received the correct size and they ensured me that it was the right size that does stretch when it's on the body. I tried it on Adriana and it did not stretch enough. <laughs> Basically it could fit maybe a doll or a newborn, um, not a one-year-old little girl and she's petite as it is so um, it was a bit of a waste. I didn't actually refund my money for that one even though I did say it was too small for her. Um, they told me to refer back to the sizing chart, which was a bit annoying. Anyways, I don't have that to show, unfortunately, but I, just so you know that not all the items that you buy from eBay or AliExpress turn out exactly how you had hoped. So I just wanted to put that disclaimer out on this video, um, because I have bought some disasters before and I'm going to show you one as well very soon. Next thing is going along the line of swimwear is just these reusable nappy pants these are the best things in my opinion for children that aren't toilet trained yet and still need one like a, and they still need a swim nappy buying those disposable swim nappies are so expensive to get especially because they only wear them once and then as soon as they're out of the water you pretty much have to throw them out and put a new one on them um, and i just find them very wasteful and bad for the environment so I invested in a bunch of these. I also have just a normal pink one um, and I think a blue one as well. But I just have this one to show you today. It's really good because they've got these little clips on the side. So you can adjust them. The next thing I want to show you is just a bunch of high knee socks. I love buying these. Not just for summer. I mean she doesn't really wear socks in summer. But for all seasons just to jazz up an outfit. Especially when she's wearing a little skirt or dress. I think these are super cute for a little girl. So I'm going to show you some of my favorites that I've bought off eBay and AliExpress. These ones just, these ones are little pink, baby pink ones with a bow. Super cute. The next one she hasn't worn yet because they were too big for her. But these are more like leg warmers. So these will be great when it actually gets cooler. And it looks like this. And the top have these super cute frills. Like that. The next one is the same as that baby pink one. But it's this burgundy red. And again with the little bow on the knee. And... She hasn't worn these ones either. They're still joined together. These ones are super cute, especially if you have like a little ballerina or a little girl that is doing some sort of dance. I just get a dance feel from these socks. So we've got a little bow with frills. And the last one she's worn before and actually still too fitter. She wore this, I think, in her 10 month um, milestone photo. And it's these little. Um, socks here with animals. I think this is a raccoon. I might be wrong. <laughs> and it looks like this. So super cute socks. Really cheap and inexpensive. And I actually can't find these sort of socks in stores. So if you are looking for high knee socks for a little girl, then definitely check out eBay and AliExpress. The next dress I'm going to show you is my disaster dress that I got from AliExpress. And I had a massive dispute with the seller on this dress. And it still has not been resolved. I bought this dress in the hopes that Adriana might wear it for her birthday. Which was back in November. 
So it has been a long process with this seller and they still are not providing any support or customer service. They're not giving me any compensation for the disaster of this dress. So like I said, I bought this dress thinking it may be nice for Adrienne to wear for her birthday as she was having a unicorn party. So I was going for like light pastel colors. So I'm going to show you the dress and then I'll explain what I didn't like about it. This is the dress here. Like, I don't know if you can tell the scale of this dress in the video, but it is humongous. This dress was meant to be a size one, but by looking at this dress, it looks like it will probably fit maybe a seven year old. It is huge and it's so wide as well. Like, it's probably as wide. It probably will actually fit my... Yep, it does. It actually fits me around my chest area so that goes to show how big this dress actually is i mean the design is very sweet i love the coloring um the material's fine there's no fault with that there's a zipper on the back like that it's got the fluffy sleeves like i do like the design and the id behind this dress but the fact that they sent me such a large size is not okay with me because I definitely ordered a size one and it shows that in my order as well. This dress has no sizing reference whatsoever on the tag. There's absolutely nothing there to indicate what size they've actually sent me. I actually measured this dress for them, took photos of it, sent it away and they're still not satisfied that they sent me the wrong size dress. So um, I guess it's safe to say that she did not wear this dress for her birthday and it was almost $15 Australian so not the cheapest of dress either but I thought it would be a pretty dress for her to wear and I'm still waiting for them to give me like some sort of solution with you know the error that has happened with sending that dress to me but I'm still waiting for that and to tell you the truth I've kind of given up now so I've just kind of let that be. Maybe she'll wear it like as a dress up dress in the future when it's not so big on her. I don't know. But anyways, just keep that in mind again when you're buying online that it might not turn out the way you had hoped, especially when it comes to sizing. I'm now down to my last dress for this haul and my absolutely favorite dress of all time since buying off ebay this has to be my number one dress so far which says a lot because i've bought a lot of things from ebay um over these many many years i'm so excited to show you this great purchase and i definitely will be buying from this seller again so this is the dress so adorable this is a size one dress and it fits her absolutely perfect just for reference i'm going to show you the difference like can you see the difference in this dress not only the height but also the width like i'll just put this at the front because it is smaller oh, it's really hard to hold up especially when it's on the hanger but this is the dress in front of the other one and it's huge so it definitely is the wrong size so i'm just going to get rid of that one for now but anyways let's go back to this beautiful number here so this is like a peach color dress or peach and white it's got these three layered um it's got like a three layered skirt and these beautiful little fluffy sleeves and my favorite part is actually the back and it ties up on the back there and it's got this like elasticated part on the back which is nice and comfy for her and yet yeah, really really pretty dress i'm wanting to set some photos now so you can see exactly what it looks like on her she actually looks like a doll with this dress on love the way it fits love the way it looks and i'm so happy with even the quality of it it's a really nice cotton material i'll leave the link down below for the listing for this because i'll definitely go back and buy some more if they've got more similar styles of this dress here i actually have seen this dress on expensive websites for children clothing 
And this is a really good dupe for that dress. I think that dress was around 40 or more dollars, where this one was a quarter of that price. So definitely a really good deal. And I'm super, super happy with this purchase. And that is the end of my eBay AliExpress haul. If you have enjoyed, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up before you exit out of this video. Subscribe down below for more videos from me. If you're interested in buying from eBay or AliExpress, don't forget to check out my eBay tips video as well. And on that note, I hope you all have a lovely day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye everyone.